fun videos so you guys seem to love my get ready with me videos so I'm gonna be doing another one today I'm getting ready for a going out shopping taking photos type of day so it's gonna be kind of glam but yet kind of natural I'm putting all the products that I'm using from today's video in this little box that I got from its cosmetics I also asked you guys on Instagram and Twitter to ask me some questions so while I'm doing my makeup I will answer some Q&A questions for you guys make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter and let's get straight on with the video all right so this is the before obviously my hair and everything is crazy so the first thing that I'm taking out is this it's cosmetics bye bye redness sensitive skin moisturizers I want to try using a moisturizer instead of a primer this moisturizer is really really nice I've been using it every night and I really like it the first question is how did you get your name so my name is Annie Rose Hope Cole I don't know if you guys know this all the girls in my family have the middle name Hope as well as like another thing so mine is Annie Rose Hope Cole I was actually named after the musical like Annie the musical my parents were gonna call me Lucy for like forever they were like okay this girl's gonna be Lucy and then they went to go see Annie and apparently my sister Lily said hey we should name her Annie and they were just like okay why not and then Rose I'm not sure I think my mom just thought it was pretty so it's nothing too exciting but imagine if my name was like Lucy Rose Hope Cole that would be so Weird. All right, so now my face is all moisturized. So next I'm taking my concealer. This one is from Too Faced and my Wet Beauty Blender. And I'm just gonna put some concealer under my eyes and on my chin. The next question is favorite thing other than shopping. <laughs> I really like to make YouTube videos, but I feel like that's kind of cheating because everyone knows I like to make YouTube videos. I really like decorating my room. Honestly, I do it all the time. I redecorate my room with like different decorations matching the season and things like like that and I don't know I feel like when I get to decorate a room I get so much joy out of it and I just love doing it shopping for it is also very fun because I love to go shopping I actually get a lot of hate on re redecorating my room too many times but I just love to do it it's so much fun speaking of makeup you guys should totally check out my makeup series that's going on right now next I'm gonna do face so like bronzer and stuff like that for my bronzer I have this palette from Tarte, it is so nice. And it's got those contour colors down at the bottom and I'm just gonna take shade Desert. For my blending brush, I have this one from It. it <gasps> their name isn't It's Cosmetics, it's It Cosmetics. I realized that my contour always turns out the best when I'm using a bigger brush, which is crazy. So yeah, I'm just gonna take a little bit of Desert. Would you ever go back to vlogging on your second channel, Annie's Vlog? So if you didn't know, I actually vlog on Annie's Vlogs for a very, very long time. You guys can check out my old videos on there. But now I just vlog on this channel. I think it's a lot more handy just vlogging on the same channel. I don't think I would ever consider going back on Annie's vlogs. I don't see the, the point. I feel like having all my vlogs and videos on one channel is cool. This palette is so pigmented, it's incredible. I'm just gonna do some on the hairline and just up here on my forehead so I look tan. Oh girl, just by the way, this is random, but I am so excited for playlists. Um, by the time you guys are seeing this, I will be leaving because I leave on Thursday and this video is posting on Thursday. I'm vlogging it and the vlogs are going up on this channel. All right, so next is highlight. Highlighter is my favorite step of makeup. For highlight today, I'm gonna be using the Tarte Exposed Highlighter. I love this one, you can see it. I've definitely made a dent in it, I love it. And I'm gonna be trying out a new highlight brush. Usually I use my Target Fan brush, but today I'm gonna be using this BH Cosmetic. It's a 137 brush, and it's a really nice, like, firm highlight brush. So the next question, how do you deal with hate? I like this question. So everyone gets hate no matter what YouTuber you are, you're going to get hate. Oh my gosh, you see that shine? This brush picks up like so much product. I usually get hate for acting too old for my age. And I mean, honestly, to deal with it, there is some comments that really get me deep down and I'm like, wow, why would that person say that about me? Overall, I just kind of ignore it, you know? Like that sounds really stupid because if you're trying to get hate and you can't ignore it, you can't really do anything about it. But when I first started getting hate it hit me deep down I was like why would it why just why would somebody say that and that's still the question to today like why would anyone go on someone's YouTube channel that they're working really hard they're a little kid and say anything rude that just doesn't make sense now I just learned to ignore it because like the people that hate they're just people that you know aren't really happy with their lives right now and they want someone to bring down and it's the same even in real life that might happen to you in real life like bullies and things like that they're just jealous or something's going really Really wrong in their life I try to feel more bad for them than than to be feel bad for myself because I know the things that they're saying aren't true we've got eyes so I'm gonna be using the 
Tartlet Toasted Palette. This is my favorite palette. It's so pretty. Oh, and it smells amazing. I'm gonna be using the BH Cosmetics, these three eyeshadow brushes. I'm using number eight, six, and seven. So before that, I have a lot of veins on my eyes, and I'm gonna cover those up by using some concealer, just as like a base, I guess you could say. Do you like wearing overalls? As I'm wearing overalls right now, I love overalls. Most of my clothing pieces are overalls. Most of my outfits on my Instagram are overalls. They're either overalls or overall dresses or the long ones and the short ones because they're so easy to wear. They're one piece so I don't really have to think about like putting together an outfit. So yes, I love wearing overalls. All right, I'm going in with the Tarte palette. S'mores, it's up in the corner right there. And I'm gonna take this brush and blend that through my crease. The next question is Instagram or Twitter? Choose one. So I have both social media platforms, Instagram and Twitter. I love both of them, especially Instagram. So I'm gonna have to say Instagram. But yeah, Twitter is really fun as well. You guys should follow me on there. Cashmere, it's the color right under it, this color. And I'm going to also blend that through my crease. Vicky Gymnast asked if Milo and Prince were girls, what would you name them? So if you didn't know, Milo and Prince are my beautiful kitties. I love them, they're so nice. If Prince was a girl, I would definitely name him Princess because I love, I wish he was a girl sometimes because I feel like Princess is such a cute little name. And if Milo were a girl, I don't know, maybe like Miley because I really like the name Milo and Miley is like the girl version of Milo. Okay, now I'm taking Latte, which is a darker color of cashmere, this color right here, and I'm going to put that on my outer corner. Do you want another cat? Oh, this question's hard because like I love my cats right now. They're so nice and I love how they how well they get along. They're like best friends. I always want more cats. That sounds really greedy, but I love cats so much and I love my cats. Every cat that we've ever gotten from PetSmart has been super nice. And so I would definitely get another cat if I had the chance. Fireside, which is that really, really dark color in the corner. And I'm gonna put some on the outer corners of my eye, very lightly though, because Fireside is a very dark color. So let's see if we can do this without, you know, destroying my makeup. Okay, I have a question for y'all. If y'all do eyeshadow, do you guys do like, do one eye at a time or both eyes at the same time? Cause I do both eyes. Now I'm just gonna get this brush again and I'm gonna put the tiniest bit of Fireside in my inner corner. Okay, the next question is your favorite types of movies and it has five likes so people really wanted to know this. And people don't usually like stuff on Instagram. I like, I like comedies the best just because I like to be entertained like that. I hate action movies like The Hunger Games. The Hunger Games is an exception because that's a good movie. All the Marvel movies, I hate all of those. I just think that they're so boring because it's like action and you know everything's gonna be fine in the end anyway. Okay, next I'm gonna take a little bit of Shimmer and Sunset together because they're sparkly and I'm just gonna put it in the middle of my eye that has no like color on it right now. So I like, I like comedy slash romance movies. I'm such a girl. Like Daddy's Home, uh, Daddy's Home 2 was so funny. What is the scariest thing that you've ever done? I went zip lining when I went on a cruise with my family and everyone loved it, but I, I still did kind of like it, but it was so scary. Like it was really, 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 really scary. And also one of the rides, cause you get stopped and then you like get readjusted and then you go on another zip line. Like there's like a whole bunch, there's like 12 courses. And one of the guys that was like with us rode with me and it was really scary because he was like really heavy and I was like, oh no, it's gonna break. So that is my eyeshadow done. Now I'm going to be doing mascara. I have two mascaras I'm gonna use. This one is from NYX, it's really nice. And this one is just from Target. It's the Maybelline Crockett Volume. I've been using this one for a long time. Now I'm gonna go in with this mascara. All right, so that is the eye look done. Next is eyebrows. Tinsley asks, what's the makeup product that you could not live without? I'm gonna say this concealer. This is my Too Faced concealer. It's really, really nice. For eyebrows, I'm gonna be using this little eye, this little eyebrow kit that I have, and I'm just gonna use this BH Cosmetics brush and just fill in my eyebrows the tiniest bit. I don't like to go too overdone with my eyebrows because I don't like to look like blocks, you know? I always mess up on my eyebrows, but it always ends up turning pretty good. See, like that. I add too much at a time. Tinsley asked again, if you could change anything about you or your body, what would you change? I would change, I'm happy with my body and my face and everything, but it, there's two things that I would change. I would change my eyes. I wish that they were bigger and I wish I had less veins on my eyelids. And I would change my eyebrows. So if you see, 
they're uneven and this eyebrow goes like up here and then it's just it's really thin all right so we're coming to an end one of the last steps is lipstick this is a little nyx soft matte lip cream i love i love this little guy you guys know i love this lipstick all right and then the last step is setting spray oh i hate setting spray it's so cold my hair is looking very voluminous today, so this is the finished look. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is the finished look. This is my outfit of the day. So the overalls are from Forever 21, and I think the crop top is actually from Forever 21 as well, from the adult section in an extra small. I love this complete outfit. I'm ready to go out and take some pictures, and I will see you guys next week.